Heavenly Father, we thank you. We bless your holy name. Glory, honor, and adoration be unto your holy name. Thank you, our Father. Thank you, our excellency. Thank you for your goodness. Thank you for your love. Thank you for your mercies. Thank you for your kindness. Thank you for all that you have done for us. We say glory be unto your holy name in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Wherever you are this morning, I want you to open your mouth and begin to appreciate the kings of kings for his greatness. I want you to appreciate him for his love. I want you to appreciate him for he has done wonderfully and perfectly well in our life. I want you to thank him. I want you to thank him. I want you to appreciate him. I want you to appreciate him for he has done what no man can do. Oh, Zikaya, Debraka, Zikayata. Ikasuka hiata, rima kasuka lipra kasiata, rika sika yada baka sunta liba kasika yata. Father, we thank you, Lord. We thank you, Lord. We thank you, Lord. O zika la rita kaya sunda libra kasiata. O shara baka sika yata. We will not stop thanking you, for you have done wonderfully well in our life. You have done greatly and greatly. You are greatly to be praised. Kasura ba ikariata. Zikayata from January till December. Oh, Zika Libra Gasu Kalipa Kayata. Oh, Rikada, you lighten of your our party, Kalibra Gasiata. You did not allow our feet to dash against Tun Silabra. Oh, Zika Sunta Lika Siata. We thank you, Lord. We thank you, Lord, for oh, Zika La Hiswata Librata Sekataya Riabaka Sunde Libaka Sunta Yada. We glorify your name. 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 Oh, say Kashi Karabaka Suntalika Rima Maga Sekariata Eka Sundalika Sintayara Rika Deka Sunda Rabaka Sanda Rabaka Siata. We glorify your name. We glorify your name. We appreciate you, Thank you, Father. Thank you, Lord. 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 You are worthy to be praised. It's a glory, honor, and adoration be unto your holy name. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Oh, thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. Amen. Yes, from the beginning of the year, God dropped a word for us. The word, he dropped a template that carried us through the year 2023. He said, this year is our year of shining light. And the light has been shining in, on our path. The light kept shining, kept shining. So I want you to, to use this opportunity. Perhaps, Rachel, there is any dark spot in your life that, oh, that, you, that you look at it and you Mm, and you and you look at it and you believe that light is supposed to have shine into this very area or light didn't shine as you were expected. But I want you to use this opportunity and beam the light into that area. Yes, beam the light because the ray of the light, light has already been released upon you. So direct that light into that situation. Direct the light of God into that circumstances. Direct the light of God concerning that issue. Direct the light of God because when the light shined, darkness comprehended it not. When the light shined over that situation, oh, the demons, the devil, whatsoever that is standing, whatsoever that is behind, will not be able to stand, will not be able to comprehend. So that's why I ask you this moment, you should give the light towards that issue. Give the light towards that peace that you are looking for. Give the light towards that sickness. Give the light towards every situation in your life. Give the light. Give it. Allow it to shine. Allow the light of God to shine. Just open your heart and allow it to flow in. Allow the light of God to shine in. Because as the light is shining, 
It's getting rid of that situation. It's getting rid of that cells. It's getting rid of that cancer cells. It's getting rid of that uh, of that sickness. It's getting rid of that symptom. It's getting rid of that adversity. It's getting it's getting it's getting rid of all of all of all that of all of all of all that is not of God in your life. The light of God is getting rid of them. Yes, it's it's is the word of God that the light shining and darkness is gone. 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 In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, Ekalubaka Sikayata, God is uprooting that every dark spot as He has beam the light towards that situation into that very dark room, into that very dark spot, into that very dark corner in your life. It's uprooting them. It's uprooting them. It's uprooting them. It's uprooting them. It's from the root, from the root, God is uprooting them out in the mighty name of Jesus. God is uprooting them out. In the mighty name of Jesus, somebody say, "Uproot, uproot them out, uproot them out, uproot them out from my life, from my finances, from my marriage, from my health, from my ministry. Uproot them, uproot them, uproot them." In the mighty name of Jesus, hey, Kashuka Takayana, it might be somebody that is standing as a stumbling block. God is uprooting that very person. In the mighty name of Jesus. In your job site, in your career, in your business place, somebody is standing as a stumbling block, is standing as a barrier. Oh, sekala prakaya! God is uprooting them. God is uprooting them. God is uprooting them. God is uprooting them. Uproot them all in the mighty name of Jesus. Uproot them all in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. In Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. In Jesus' mighty name, we are praying. Amen. Amen. The title of our message this day is Who is flocking you? Who is flocking me? Who is flocking us? Who is flocking you? Hey, Zadika Sukataya. Hey, Shadabaka Sikayata. Who is flocking you? Who is beating you? Because when we talk of flocking, it is when you have been, someone has been subjected, when someone has been overpowered, when somebody has no power of his own, when somebody cannot resist, and when they take it as a right, and they will be hitting, they will be beating the person just as they want, as they like. Number of times just don't matter. They will be hitting the person day and night. They will be beating, they will be flogging the person in the day. They will be flogging the person in the night. They will be flogging the person in the noon day. Even while you are walking, sometimes you hear it on your back and you look back and you didn't see anybody because they are flogging someone. Someone that is standing to flog you is standing out there in the realm of the spirit is committing this atrocity. Tonight, we are asking, who is flocking me? It's a question that you need to ask. They have been flocking you from January. They have been secretly, they have been secretly flocking you, flocking you in, your, in the area of your business, flocking you in the area of marriage, 
flocking you in the area of your health, flocking you, oh, Sadaka Sita, no wonder you move out, you were walking, you were talking, and no, we were talking, and without anybody on the side, you were just talking on yourself alone, because the wife, the way they were flocking you, you couldn't resist it, you begin to talk on your own, in the midnight, you wake up and talk, even while you were sleeping, somebody said you were sleeping and you were talking, what were you talking because you were being flogged, you were being beaten. Hey, who is flogging you? Who is beating you? Lahuzi Kalipa Kashatakaya, Riaka Sakayata, whosoever, wherever they have brought, wherever they have gone, wherever they have Kasikayata. Wherever they have cooked up this, wherever they are doing this manipulation, wherever they have subjected one to this. Father, tonight, let that ground break and let the head open its mouth and let them be swallowed in the mighty name of Jesus. Who is flocking me? Who is flocking you? Who is beating you? Who is flocking you? When you pick something up and they look at it, say, look at this one. He wants to pick something. He wants to progress. And they will flock it until you drop it. And you make a sukayata. Something that was making meaning. Something that was making sense. Before you know it, you just drop it like that physically. But you don't know that they have been flocking you to drop it spiritually. Who has been flocking you to drop that thing? I say, fire of God. I release fire of God. I release fire of God. I release fire of God. Enter. Enter into that shrine. Enter into that coven. Enter into that shrine. Enter into that coven. Consume, consume, say consume, consume them, consume, consuming fire, consuming fire, consume them in the mighty name of Jesus. Who is flocking you? When you did nothing wrong, because they just hate you, just for no reason. You are not the first person. Perhaps you are looking at it. Let me manage. Libra It is no more. It is not time for you to manage it any longer. We cannot manage negativity. I say I will not manage negativity. Somebody declare. From this day onward, I refuse to manage negativity in the mighty name of Jesus. From this day onward, I refuse to manage the blocking from the camps of the enemy. From this day onward, I refuse to manage the blocking from the camps of the enemy. From this day onward, I refuse. I will not manage negativity any longer. In the mighty name of Jesus, Zadaka Sikayata, open your mouth and begin to declare, Laka Sikayata, I refuse. I refuse to manage negativity. I refuse to manage negativity. I refuse to manage manipulation of the enemies. I refuse to be manipulated. I refuse. Open your mouth and pray that prayer. That day, la tu da di kasi kaya ta. Eisha ta kaya kaya. Ria kasa ta kata kaya. Ria kasa ta kata kaya. La kasa ta kata kaya. Ria kasa ta kata. I refuse. I refuse. I refuse. Libra Casuta Cayata, Rima Cassiata, Rabaca, Rabaca, Zilava, Rabaca, Yabaca, 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 Libra, Zikayara, fire, 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 fire of God, fire of God, consume, 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 in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Mm. They kept Libra Cast. Mm. Lima Casucatakaya. Mm. Your hair is just falling off. Your hair is just falling and you are looking, what is wrong with this, my hair? He has been falling, I'm doing this, I've done that. 
I've put this, I've put this, I've given him banana, I've given him this, I've given him this, that. Yet the hair is falling. Leave back as theater. They have subjected you as a as a rat in the in, in the witchcraft community. When they eat finished, they will come and, and wipe your hand on it. That's why the hair has been falling. Today, we are putting a stop. Who has been flocking you that way? Using your hair to be cleaning hand when they finish eating. No wonder your hair is falling. And you didn't take note of that. For you, that the hair has been falling without any, anything. You have been looking for means to stop it. Today, I put a stop to that in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I put a stop to that in the mighty name of Jesus. I put a stop to that in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Somebody said, no more, no more, no more. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Mm. They subjected some people. They picked them. They keep them in their prison. They do them as they like. Mm. They flog them at ease. Anytime they like. They flog hell out of some people and they are enduring. You understand those children in those days, you know, like when they used to flog, uh, it just that, that just really used to happen in during in the primary school. Some some so students will carry book and put for their and put for their bag, put for their for their bumble and put it there so that when when they flog them. When they flood them, the king will not touch them. They devise a means to accommodate that flocking. I don't know in what way that you have devised a means to accommodate that even when they beat you, you will endure. You will take painkiller. Because others will, so that others will not laugh. Or you will not like, uh, like other people to love you. You endure. You will just tighten your face. They will be giving you toi, 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 toi. And you move. <laughs> Today, who are they? Who are these people? Who are these people that are subjected you to this kind of pain? It is pain. In pain, they are standing behind you, and you understand what, what how these people operate. They stand behind you, and they are giving you. They are flocking when the person less expected. They are flocking when the person less expected. Amen. Even when you are doing the right thing. They will just go ahead and flock you without looking back. You are doing what you're supposed to do. They will flock. They have subjected you to that. And they are flogging day and night. You wanted to eat. They flock. They ask you, who told you to, to eat? Who asked you to eat by this time? Because they are not the because they have not commanded you to eat. They flock. Even when breakthrough showed up and you want to put your head, they flock you. You, you want to prosper. They will ask you, if everybody wants to prosper, you, you want to prosper. They flock you. Go back. You want to marry, you say, for what? They flock you back. Anything, anytime good thing is coming, you see them standing, they flock you. When, when they flock you, you will be running. 
you will be running back. That's why you see many people are returning back to where they started. They flood them back to square one. Hmm. Because of flocking, you cannot attain the level that you're supposed to attain. You want to rise. They will so flock you that you will, you, you will even, you, you will promise yourself that you will not even make that attempt again. Who are these people? The flock. Flocking. We will revise that flocking tonight. We are going to revise that flocking tonight. Let's open our Bible to the book of Acts. Acts chapter 5. Here the apostles, they were doing their thing. They were preaching. But because of those persecuting their work, their good work, those that do, doesn't want to see them succeeding in doing their own thing, they throw them into prison. And before they knew what was happening, God released them from prison. And they were looking all around. Where are they? And the men were still preaching. They went back and arrested them. So for you to have escaped the first one does not mean that these people will stop. So many of us, God has rescued us. But because we, do, we still remain in that periphery, they return back. And they are still flocking many of you. Amen. Let's read from verse 37. He said, after this man, Judas of Galilee rose up in the days of census and drew away many people after him. He also per perished and all who obeyed him were dispersed. 38. And now, I say to you, keep away from this man and let them alone. For it, if this plan or this work is of men, it will come to nothing. But if it is of God, you cannot overthrow it. These are the people doing the work of God. And people rise up against them. They want, to quench, they want to silence them, just as people have risen up in our different background to silence us from doing what we are supposed to do. I don't know who has risen up to silence you. But there was an advice that they should allow them to be, that if their work is the work of God, no one can stop it, but if it is the work of men, that they, it will definitely come to nothing. It's at least you even be found to fight against God so that they will not fight against God. He tell them that this thing that you people want to do, just leave these people. If their work is the work of God, if it is the work of men, if they're just doing it out of their own, it will come to nothing. It will just die silently. But if it is the work of God, Nobody can overthrow it. And if you try to fight, you are fighting against God. So when we are doing what we are supposed to do, when we do what God has called us to do, and somebody is fighting us, the person is fighting God. The enemy knows this. Yes, the wicked one knows this. They say we will be fighting God. Verse 40. He said, and they agreed with him. They agreed. 
They do give advice. They do give us advice to themselves. They agreed with him. And when they had called for the apostles and beaten them and commanded that they should not speak in the name of Jesus and let them go. They found that nothing happened, but they do what? They flog them. Amen. They did what? They beat them up. Instead to them, let them go free. They, they beat them up. Even for something that they have not done wrong, they beat them up. Amen. Let me read from this translation. He said they took his advice. When this advice was given to them, they took his advice. And after calling the apostles in, they flogged them and ordered them. They do what? They flog them. They have said that they cannot do anything. Or they have said that these people have not done anything wrong. But they go ahead to flog them. Just as many of us who have not done anything wrong to them. And they are doing what? They have defies means to do what? To flog hell out of some people. They have defies means. That even when you were not wrong, even when you have not committed any sin against them, that they will do what? They will flog them. What did they do to these apostles? They flogged them. They flogged them and ordered them not to speak. You see, after flogging them, they, don't, they, they will not just allow you to go free. They will give you order not to do the right thing that you're supposed to do. They will give you order not to enter into your next level. They will give you order not to do the right thing that you're supposed to do. They will give you order not to prosper. They will give you, they will restrain you. They will do what? They will restrain you from doing or from getting to the level that you're supposed to have to have gotten to. So these people are wicked men. Who are they? They are the wicked men. These wicked men, they appear in our, in our respective background. We can find them, even in our paternal home, in our, we can find them. They are there everywhere. The wicked people, they are always trying to do what? To hinder us. And after flocking, they will do what? They will restrain. They will restrain you. They will become an, a stumbling block. They will give you an order. Who is giving you that evil order? Who is preparing you against year 2024? Many people, they have already flogged them and set their mentality that 2024, that you will not go anywhere, you will not prosper. Whosoever that has done this evil to die by the name that is above every other name, by the name that is above every other name, in the name of Jesus Christ, let the fire of God come down and devour them. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, let the fire of God come down and devour them. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, who has restrained you, say in the year 2024, that you will not get into your promised land. I say, let the fire of God consume them. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, who has flogged you and put an order and put an injunction saying, that in the year 2024, 2024, that you will not get married. I said, let the fire of God turn. Let the fire of God consume them in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Let the fire of God consume them. Who has restrained, who has put that negative order? Who has put this order saying that in the year 2024, that you will not be in good health? Hey, Sadika Nuabakasiatal. I said, let the fire of God consume them in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Hmm. They flog them and order them. Who is giving you that order? Who is giving you the order not to prosper? Who is giving you the order not to be in good health? Who is giving you the order? Who is giving you that order not to progress? 
Who is giving you that order not to achieve what God has already prepared for you? Who is giving you that order, that restraining order not to excel in life? Today we cancel every negative order concerning us. In the mighty name of Jesus, we cancel, we cancel their order. We cancel their order. In the mighty name of Jesus, we cancel their order. In the mighty name of Jesus, we cancel their order. In the mighty name of Jesus, that negative order huh, concerning our family, we cancel them up. In the mighty name of Jesus, that negative order, we cancel them up. In the mighty name of Jesus, we cancel them up. In the mighty name of Jesus, we cancel them. We scatter them. We destroy them. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Shanda da wakasikayata. Libra kasukayata. Hey, sikayata. Handa yada. Libra kasikayata. When Jesus has already received the flocking, when God has, when Jesus has already received the flocking, so who is he? Who is this wicked man that wants to come and flog me again after Jesus Christ has already received the flock from my sake? Affliction. It shall not rise again. I said it shall not rise again in your life. Neither shall will it rise again in my life. In the mighty name of Jesus. It will not rise again in the life of your children. It will not rise again concerning your business. It will not rise again concerning your health. It will not rise again concerning your children. It will not rise again concerning your wife. It will not rise again concerning your husband. It will not rise again concerning your career. It will not rise again concerning your business. It will not rise again concerning your job. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Mm. It will not rise again. In Isaiah chapter 50 verse 6. Isaiah chapter 50, verse 6. He said, I gave my back to those who strike me. I gave my back to those who strike me. To those who flog me. They use koboku. You know what is koboku? That's horse one. That horse me. That has many channels. That when they use it once, hmm, one will be going, you one will go, they are going different, different area. You would you would not know how to react. That Kuboko we will return it to them tonight. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Isaiah chapter 50 verses. He said, I gave my back to those who strike me and my cheek to those who pluck out my beard. Do you know what it means to pluck out? Hey, hey. do you know what it means to pluck one beard out? Hey, hey, hey. Do you know how painful it is? He said, I did not cover my face from humiliation and spitting. Yet someone want to repeat that same thing. He want to come and pluck another baby again from my face. It will not happen again. Somebody say it will not happen again. In the mighty name of Jesus, it will not happen again. In the mighty name of Jesus. They will not pluck your beard. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. They will not pluck it. Jesus Christ has already done that. And yet somebody is defacing means to repeat what has already taken place. Or what has already been seen. Who is that good? Who is that animal? Who is that wicked soul? Tonight. We are going to revise 
We are going to revise. We are going to revise it. We are going to revise it. And we are going to revise it. Wherever they are hidden in my life, to flock me at the back. Foul ghost fire. Wherever they are hidden in my life, to flock me where I want to rise. Holy ghost fire. Wherever they are hiding in my life, wherever, whosoever that is hiding around me in my life, in my career, in my business, wherever they are hiding, flocking me, flocking the works of my hand, flocking my business, flocking my finances, flocking my health. Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost, fire, consume them. Wherever you are this moment, I want you to open your mouth and begin to declare whosoever that is hiding in my life or hiding around me to be flocking me against my will, against the will of God in my life. Holy Ghost fire consume them. Holy Ghost fire consume them. In the mighty name of Jesus, open your mouth and begin to declare Zadaya, Zakaya, Keshatakaya, Keshatakaya, Likasikaya, Epalapatakaya. Rabaka satakaya, Libra kasatakaya, Rabama bakasiata, Ekatakayata, Libra kasikayata, Ekashatakayata, Libra kasuntaya, Ekasiata, Rika sukayata, Ekshatakayata, Ekapatakaya, Eksikayata, Libra kasia, Lako shatakaya, Eksalabakayata, Riaka satakaya, Ekashatakaya, Maya. Fire, 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 Holy Ghost, 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 fire. In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. Have you ever seen somebody that is being given kuboku at the back? That is being given this uh this this beating, this horse at the back, the person will be, the person will be dancing. I don't know whether he will not be dancing because the person is in pain. But the action you will see, you will thought that it's a kind of dance that the person is dancing. You will be thinking that the person is dancing a kind of break dance. There is no break dance. The person is in pain. The person is confused. The person is suffering. Ah, and they keep giving him. You know, when they give you once, it will turn this side. They give another one. It will turn. It will give. And before you know it, the person will be, the, when the person will be turning, and they will be laughing. And they will be laughing. Whosoever that is laughing over my calamity, let them go in for it in the mighty name of Jesus. Whosoever that is laughing, that is making mockery of me, over my pain, let the pain revise back to them in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. It was that same thing that Haman was, it was, a, it was a professional in doing such things. That's why he did that candle, preparing it for Mordecai. He was waiting so that on that very fateful day, he would be dying, he would be laughing, he would be saying, Mordecai, I try. He would be saying, Mordecai, I shake. He would be, you know, he would be making mockery of him. God is God. He turned, he turned things around. He revised it. Ah, Sikayata. On that same God, he was he that was being hung. Others were looking. Others were watching. Just as he was expecting to be a, to be a, to, to watch. It was others that watched him go into what he was prepared. Whosoever that is preparing him. Whosoever that is waiting to flog you here and there, hey, Sikala Pakayata, I replace him in that position. Let him face the music. Let him face the flocking. Let him face the flocking in the mighty name of Jesus. It doesn't matter the number of counts. But today, let the count begin. Let the judgment begin. Let them begin to enjoy it in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Lika sukaya, lima kasiata, raba kasikayata, hexika la payata. Let them begin to enjoy it. Hmm. We did not just come here tonight to come and be playing. 
They have flocked you for too long. They have been flocking. Imagine the children in the land of Egypt. They are doing, they, they are doing what they're supposed to do, and they are being flocked of all. And look at the, the apostles that they, they, they throw into the into the prison. Even when they found nothing against them, they still they, they were delighted in flocking them. Who is delighted in flocking you? Causing pain in your life, causing sorrow, causing shame. Mm. Who is being, hey, who is being, you know, they derive satisfaction in your own pain. When they flock you, the way, the way someone is twisting, twisting his or her back is what gives them joy. Is what give, makes them to laugh. Somebody say abomination. It is an abomination for someone to be, you know, to be celebrating in your own pain. Mm. Somebody to be deriving joy through your pains. Hey, hey. And you will not open your mouth to pray. Pray this prayer. Pray. Whosoever that has been deriving joy through my pains, Father, let the sword of the Lord come down and destroy them in the mighty name of Jesus. Open your mouth and pray that prayer. Zadika Sikayata. Whosoever that is deriving joy through your pains, let the sword of the Lord slay them, slay them tonight. 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 In the mighty name of Jesus. Then the sword of the Lord. Let the sword of the Lord slay them. In the mighty name of Jesus. Let it slay them tonight. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. And listen. You know this witchcraft. They take people to their kobu. Even while the person is walking around physically doing his own thing. But spiritually, in their coven, they are tormenting the person. And after tormenting the person, you now see the manifestation of your torment being, being, being surfaced, being manifested in the life of that person. There are some people that have been chained, and they have been chained down, and they are flogging the people every now and then. As the year is running, that is what, is what they are using to entertain themselves by flogging, by flogging her. By flocking, by flocking, I don't know what I will say. Mm. When, yes, when they cut out, when they sit down, what do they do? They derive, they re, they derive their joy through their pains by doing what? By tormenting you, by beating you up, by flocking the person. You will not be in that position in the mighty name of Jesus. In the year 2024, you will not be in any position where the enemy will be flocking you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I say the enemy will not be, will, the enemy will not have access to you that they will subject you to a position where they will be flocking you day and night in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Where the hell Samson? Samson were, was going through pains and that was their entertainment. It was an entertainment for them. They removed his eyes and it was entertainment for them. His head was being cut off. The hair was shaved and it was entertainment. He was being restrained, he was chained. He was chained, he was in leg chain, he was in hand chain. And that was their entertainment. Who has subjected you to any kind of pain and they are using it as their entertainment? Who in that covenant, who in that witchcraft covenant has taken you there? I say, who has taken you to that witchcraft covenant? Who has taken you to that witchcraft covenant tonight? We are making a declaration. Whosoever that has taken me to witchcraft covenant, in order for me to be flogged, Holy Ghost fire and destroy them. 
Holy Ghost fire and destroy them. Open your mouth and begin to pray. Whosoever that has taken me, taken my name, take what belongs to me, to witchcraft covenant, in order for me to be flogged, in order for me to be beaten up. Holy Ghost fire and destroy them. Destroy them. Destroy them. In the mighty name of Jesus. Destroy them. In the mighty name of Jesus. Destroy them. Destroy them. Destroy them. Destroy them. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Destroy them. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Destroy them. In the mighty name of Jesus. Whatsoever they have used to represent you in the witchcraft covenant. And they have been flocking. And whenever they are flocking that thing, whenever they are flocking that calf image, it's having an effect. It's having an effect on you. I said to them, Holy Ghost fire, Holy Ghost fire, consume the witches, which is a wizard, a kalapakaya, rika sikayata, manipulating them, manipulating me, manipulating flocking upon my life, upon my destiny, upon my world, upon my ministry. Holy Ghost fire, destroy them, destroy them. Destroy them, destroy them, destroy them, destroy them. Whatsoever they have taken into the witchcraft covenant to represent me and they are flocking that particular thing to have effect on me, to have effect on my business, to have effect on my ministry, to have effect on my career, to have effect on me. Holy Ghost fire, destroy them, destroy them, destroy them, destroy them, destroy them, destroy them. Destroy them, destroy them, destroy them, destroy them in the mighty name of Jesus. A Satakayata, whosoever, any man that has been taken to witchcraft covenant and they have been waiting, they have been flocking. A Kadika Siata, they have been flocking his private part. And Adika Sikayata, and in the physical, he does not have erection any longer today by the power that is above every other power. Holy Ghost fire, destroy, destroy, say that destroy that people, destroy such power, destroy them all and set him free, destroy them all and set him free. Whosoever, Lika Sikayata, it is the manipulation at the witchcraft covenant. And today, Lika Sukayata, Rika Sikayata, because of the beating, because of the flocking, you cannot, uh, you cannot make. You cannot rise. It cannot rise. It cannot rise. Today, it is Kaluba, Lika Sikaya, Lika Siata, Rabakataya, Rapakataya, Rapakataya, Holy Ghost Fire, Rika Sikayata, set him free, set them free, set them free, set them free. Eka Sukayata, the one, O Lord, that is being beaten at the witchcraft cover, that the womb, O Lord, cannot carry a child. Today, O oh Lord, O oh Kadipa Kaya, we put a stop. Lika Sikayata, we Takasiata, Holy Ghost Fire, whatsoever they were holding at the witchcraft covenant. When they pounded in that mortar, the womb would not be able to carry any baby. Today, O oh Lord, we destroy that thing. Holy Ghost Fire, Holy Ghost Fire, consume that object, consume that egg, consume that object, consume that gravity event. In the mighty name of Jesus, whatsoever they have been using, beating it up. Zula Bakasiata, Rika Satakaya, Rabada Bakaya, in that shrine, in that covenant, and the crowning image, that baby doll, as they are beating it, as they are hitting it, they say, Kalaba, then you cannot carry baby, then you cannot be pregnant. Today, oh Lord, we put an end to it. Holy Ghost fire, consume the man, consume the egg. Consume the altar, consume the covenant. Holy Ghost fire, Holy Ghost fire, Holy Ghost fire. Talabaka siat, talabaka siat, talabaka siat, talabaka siat. Eka sikayata. Whosoever that has taken your arm, that has taken your pocket, that has taken your wallet, that has taken your purse into the witchcraft covenant, they have been hitting it, giving you a restriction not to have money in it. Aka sukayata. Waiting, oh Lord, waiting uh, that whenever you put the money, they will take it from you. Today, Holy Ghost fire, Holy Ghost fire, destroy them, destroy them, destroy them. Whosoever is after the words of your hand, is after your business, is hitting something up, is hitting it, is shaking it, and the witchcraft cover in order for your money to scatter, to scatter, not to be able to stay in your hand. 
today we say fire, Holy Ghost fire, Holy Ghost fire, consume them, scatter them, destroy them, scatter them, destroy them, Holy Ghost fire, Holy Ghost fire, Holy Ghost fire, whosoever he can fire is putting up an evil order, preparing 2024 to be ruled, to be ruled, a fire. Bad. destroy them. Their blood, O oh Lord, it will not stand. Their blood, O oh Lord, it shall not stand. Ikalapara, Rikasiata, Ekatakai, Likasikai, Echanakaya, it shall not stand. Neither will it come to pass. Echalapakaya, Zikalapakaya, Rabakasiata, Likasukayata, Echatakaya, Ekalapataya, Ekasikayata, Ekalapaya, Riakaswata. Echatakaya, wherever Olam, they are doing the manipulation. Ekadubakayata, Sikalapakaya, Riakasatakaya, 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 Riakasatakaya. Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost, let the sword of the Lord enter the sword of slaves, slay the mighty, enter into their, into their secret place. Destroy them, destroy them, destroy them, destroy them, destroy them. Any man, any woman. Whether it's sister, whether it's brother, whether it's auntie, whether it's uncle, Holy Ghost fire, Holy Ghost fire, Holy Ghost fire, destroy them, destroy, Holy Ghost fire, Holy Ghost fire, destroy them, destroy them, Holy Ghost fire, Holy Ghost fire, destroy them, consuming fire, consuming fire, consuming fire, consuming fire, destroy them. Hey, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Whatsoever they have been manipulating today, it has come to an end in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Mm. Let us revise it now. Let us revise it now. Open your book. Open your Bible to the book of Deuteronomy. Deuteronomy chapter 25. Kasiata. Lapaka Sunayadahanda. Rabaka Sikayata. 25 from verse 2. I will read verse 2 and 3. Lipa Kasiata. Ekariawas. Thank you, Jesus. He said, Then it shall be if the wicked man deserve to be beaten. Then it shall be if the wicked man deserve to be beaten. Are they deserve to be beaten? Are they deserve to be flogged? The one that they don't allow you to carry your baby. Are they deserve to be beaten? The one that they don't allow you to carry your document. Are they deserve to be beaten? The one that they don't allow you to succeed. Are they deserve to be beaten? I want you to answer this question very sincerely. Since be sincere to yourself. Be sincere to yourself. I don't know whether you are the one that they don't allow person to succeed. So that's why you are not answering if you are the one. If you are the one, you better confess. If not, we are flocking you among. We are going to flock you, flock you, flock the flock that nonsense out of your life. He said, then it shall be if the wicked man deserves to be beaten. The wicked man that did not allow you, did not allow your business to prosper. I hear you saying, I forgive him. If you forgive him, you can just lock out. You can just go out. Just go out. Just go out first after you come back. Because right now we are going to flop the hell. We are, we, we are going to do otherwise. We are not... If you say you forgive him, you can step out. When we finish, you can come in. Amen. If they deserve to be beaten and you say, you say you forgive him, you say you forgive her, I wonder who you are. Maybe you are one of them. If, if, you, are, if you forgive them, right, say I forgive them. If you forgive them, right, say I forgive them, right, let me see, so that I will know that you are one of them. Amen. I'm serious. It's not a loving matter, Mama. 
if you're one of them that say, I forgive them, the Bible says, then it shall be if the wicked man deserves to be beaten. He said, the judge shall then make him lie down. Yeah. <laughs> you see how the things sweet. This is what they are done. They will make them to do what? To lie down, lie down. You understand what they say? Lie down, lie down, lie down, lie down. <laughs> lie down. Tell your enemy, tell the wicked one, say lie down. Tell him authoritatively, lie down. Mm. Mm. He said the judge shall then make him lie down and be beaten in his presence with the number of stripes according to his guilt. I feel like, you know, if we, you know, it is in this kind of situation that people will bring their own cane and be flocking them. Mm. Mm. We are going to flood them. Look for something. Look for gain. Look for wife. Look for housewife. Look for it. Whatsoever you use at hand, we will pray. It will no longer be that particular thing, but it will be the gain from, from God that when you use it, if it is your belt, lose your belt. Use it. Mm. Use it. If you can carry your knife, use your knife and beat them with your knife. Mm. If you have their picture, bring their picture. Let them, tell them to lie down. Mm. Oh yeah, prepare, prepare, prepare. We are going to pray this prayer. Prepare, prepare. Prepare, prepare. Prepare, let me bring one. Yes. Yes, I'm back. Shaka sika la pakayata. E libra ka suka la pakanta ya. Reke sika patakata ya. La paka 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 pakata ya. Rabababa kataka ya. E sika la kashataka ya. Rika satakata ya. E shanta ka suata ya. Libra ka sika yata. Rabaka suta kayata, ekshata kata kata ya. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Hey, sika la pakayata. Are you people with me? Hey, sika. If you are ready, say I am ready. If you are ready, say I am ready. If you are ready, say I am ready. I don't know where you are, but I am ready to flood them out. In the mighty name of Jesus, we are going to read that place again. If you know them by their name, you call them by their names. Deuteronomy chapter 25, verse 2. He said, Then it shall be he, if the wicked man, wicked man or woman, a wicked man or woman deserve to be beaten. The judge begin to begin to look. Maka sikayata concerning that situation, concerning the pain that they have caused you, 
concerning the stagnation that they have caused you, concerning the pain that they have caused you to pass through, and they deserve to be beaten, this night we are going to beat them off. As the judge, he said, the judge shall then make him to lie down. The judge, I stand at the place of the judge. God has already given them sentence. He said, they, uh, they deserve to be beaten. So I represent the judge this night. And I ask them to lie down. I give you the command. Tell them to lie down. Lie down. Lie down. Lie down. You deserve to be beaten. You lie down. You deserve to be beaten. He said, and they be beaten in his presence with the number of stripes according to his guilt. How many number? The num with the, according to his guilt. If you know how painful the what how what he has caused in your life, you can just strike him once. If you know if it was really painful, you can strike him too. If it was really painful, you can give him uncountable times. Begin to strike them, begin to flood them now. Flood them in the name of God. When, I, when we declare in the name of God, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost, you begin to flood them in the name of God, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost. We flood them in the mighty name of Jesus. Wherever you are, begin to flood them, begin to flood them, begin to flood them. Exikayata, Rabaka Sikayata. You that does not allow good things to flow. You that does not allow good things to flow in my life. You that does not allow good things to flow. You that does not allow good things begin to flow them. Shataka takaya. Zada wakata. Rakasa takataya. Rakasa takataya. Begin to flow them. Begin to flow them. Zada wakasa taya. Rakasa takataya. 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 Every wicked man, every wicked man, which is a wizard, every stumbling block, any wicked man, you deserve to be beaten. I beat you today in the name of the Lord. I beat you today in the name of the Lord. I beat you today. You which is a wizard, you which is a wizard, family witches, family witches, family wizards, wherever you are, in my surrounding, in my community, I flock you tonight. I flock you tonight. I flock you tonight. I beat you with the wife of the Lord. I flock you. Exakaya. 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 Continue. 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 Shalabada. Shalabada. Salabaya. Salabada. 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 Ragadaya. 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 Jesus Christ, we have beaten them. A hey, calabar, they deserve to be beaten. We have not thrown yet. We have not thrown yet. In the name of Jesus, any man, any man that is plotting evil against your future, any man that is plotting evil against your destiny, anyone that is plotting evil against your 2024, they deserve to be beaten. Any man, we call out all of them. Call out all of them. Put them. Ask all of them. All of them, wherever they are, to lie down here, lie down here. Any man plotting evil to hinder me, to cause stagnation, to cause retrogression, to cause rising and falling, whosoever the person may be, lie down here. Any man oppressing me, any man waiting for me to walk so that they will collect from me, call, begin to call, begin to call them, begin to call them. Any man that does not want you to have baby, anyone that does not have one. To have to, 
doesn't want to see you prospering, doesn't want to see you being fruitful. Any man that does not want to see the ministry going forward, anyone that is plotting your downfall, we say, lie down here. Because you deserve to be beaten. We beat you, begin to beat them. We beat you up. You that is plotting evil against my 2024. Receive, 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 receive. Chara, Chara, Lakaya, Lakaya, Rakaya, 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 Rakadea, 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 Jatara, 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 Tataya, 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 Flog them, meet them up, them up. They desire to be beaten. They desire to be beaten. Meet them up, them up, them up. Chatua, Chatua, Lakaraba, Rakaraba, Lakaraba, Lakaraba, Lakaraba. Anyone standing against your finances, meet them up. Anyone standing against your children, meet them up. Any man. Study against your marriage, meet them up. Anyone study against your good health, meet them up. Anyone study against your blessing, meet them up. Anyone study against your will, meet them up. Against your marriage, meet them up. Against your peace, meet them up. Against your ministry, meet them up. Against your ministry, meet them up. Against your finances, meet them up. Against your good health, meet them up. Against your ministry, meet them up. Against your doctor, meet them up. Against your peace, meet them up. Ekana, Sikaira, Ekaira. It is my help. I beat them. 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 In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, we are praying. In Jesus' mighty name, we are praying. In Jesus' mighty name, we are praying. Father, whosoever in the realm of the spirit, in witchcraft cover, that is plotting evil against us. Father, let the angels, we release the angels, we release the angels, go in there and beat them up. As we have done this, oh Lord, we do this, oh Lord. Let the real beating, let the angels carry on with the real beating. Let the angels continue. Let the angels continue. Let the angels carry on from here. Let the angels carry on from them. Whether the person is my mother, whether the person is my father, whether the person is my brother, whether the person is my sister, oh Lord, look at them and beat them up. Any man that is causing, that is causing pain, that is causing stagnation, that is causing sickness, that is causing pain, pain of any kind, that is causing dryness, that is causing poverty, that is causing rising and falling, whatsoever that they have caused in your life, whosoever, that is responsible for that. We beat them up. Let Angel Michael, the war angels, carry on from there. Continue from there. Block them, O Lord. Block them, O Lord. And let them go. Block them and take away their peace. Block them and take away their peace. Block them and take away their senses. E kachataya, e kachatakaya, e kachataya. Rapa, ragada, 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 Jalaba, Jalaba, Rabada, 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 Rabada,
any man that is after your peace, any man that is after your job, any man that is after your peace, any man that is after your health, flog them, flog them now, flog them now, flog them now, flog them now, flog them now. Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost, release that Kariata. Holy Ghost, Rabadabada. We release that Koboko, Rika Sigayata, in the realm of the spirit. Flog them, flog them, flog them, Lord. Flog them, angels, flog them. Shadwa, Shadwa, Shadabadaba, Raka Sigayata, Ekashatakaya, Lipra Kasataya, Ekashatakaya, Rabadabada, 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 Rabadabada. In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. The kings of kings and the Lord of lords, who is on his throne, looking down, seeing all what is happening, will not allow them to go free. Because they deserve to be beaten. Let the beating continue. Let this beating continue in their life. Let the angels beat every good thing out of their life. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, whosoever that doesn't want us to see, wasn't, doesn't want to see us moving ahead, moving forward, moving to another level, let the angels of the Lord destroy them, beat them up, scatter them, scatter them, scatter them, cut them off in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Mm. Weeping, weeping will not cease, will not cease in their life. I say weeping will not cease in their life. When somebody is being beaten, the person will cry. The sound of cry will not cease in their in their wailing. They will they will be wailing. Wailing will not cease. Will not cease in their life. In the mighty name of Jesus, mourning mm, it will not cease in their life. In the mighty name of Jesus, somebody say thank you, Jesus. Open your mouth and begin to thank God for this wonderful thing that the Lord has done. For God to prepare your 2024 in this way. Is beating those, is crushing them, is flocking the hell out of those, is flocking putties out of those that were a those that were putting, those that were standing against your progress, those that were standing against your the, the good news. Hey, they were just standing. If any good news want to come, they will flock you. But today, God has revised the case. God has revised the case. God has revised the case. God has revised the case in my life. In the life of my wife, in the life of my children, in this ministry, upon Shekinah and Gloria says, Church, God has revived the case. So shall it be in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. So shall it be in the name of God, the Father, the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen and amen. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. God bless you. I feel relieved in my spirit. Yes. You will have encounter even in your dream. When you have it, you bring it. You share it to the glory of God. Some people will confess. Some people will confess. They will call you and beg you. So be mindful how you remember, be mindful how you tell people sorry. Be mindful. They will tell you how oh, my body is paining me. My body, all my body is like, yeah, I don't know what is happening. And you begin to say sorry, sorry. If you are saying sorry, it's just like, okay, you are forgiven you. You have released them from the beating. When once you say sorry, that means you have released them from the from the beating. That's what they will be looking for. When once you say sorry, you have released them. So be careful, be mindful of what you say when you receive such call. Amen. So tomorrow morning, still remain our bed clinic. And in the evening, our prayer continue. Don't forget our... Our Thanksgiving is coming. It's coming on the 31st, on the Sunday, on Sunday. Then crossover. 
10 p.m. in the night. So let's cross before crossing. Let's cross, come and join us and let us cross together. We have been together, so it will not be nice for us to cross and leave you behind. So let us cross together. Then later on, you can tell other people that you have already crossed. And whatsoever they will be doing will just be a formalities. Amen. So see you tomorrow. And if you were not here from the beginning, go to our YouTube channel and look for this, uh, this message. I will upload it later in the day. So go there and pray along. Yes. I believe it's, as Mama said, it's a must watch. It's preparing you for 2024. Those that has been flocking good things out of your life, we have revised the situation. We flock them. We flock them. We flock them. They don't have that capacity. They don't have that authority to flock us and give us a restraining order not to go ahead, not to go and prosper, not to go and be in good health not to go and marry, not to go and possess our possession. So such order has been counseled. We have returned back to them. Mm. Yes. We have given them wood to wood to. Amen. With Koboko, Holy Ghost Koboko. We give them Koboko at the back. The angels is going along with them, wherever they can with that Koboko. That horse whip, giving them. You know what they do like this? That's how I, I know how to use it very well. You don't just do like, you just do like this. If you do two times like this, it will, when it comes to the person head, some will come to ear, some will go to the neck, some will go to the back. The person will be, will be dancing and makosa. God is releasing it to upon them. The angels will just be standing by, giving them anything they want to do. They will not have time to be looking at you, to be thinking about you, to be on how to destroy you. It is settled tonight in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, we flood them. Many of them will land in emergency unit. Yes. That's why when they call on you, do not just release them like that. Ah, do not release them like that. When once they just call you, what happened? Sorry, oh, sorry, oh, sorry. You see my body, you see my body, I don't know what happened. You say, sorry. You just, you say, see my body, eh. Your body, see your body. What did happen? <laughs> We say now you know, for this kind of time. If you don't know how to wait to tell the person, if the person say for this kind of time, now they beat you, who beat you? Okay. Mm. It would try look for means how you will tell the person sorry. Don't stay long because if you stay long, you will not remember the time you say sorry, and that is what they are looking for. And once you say sorry, they are relieved. Amen. God bless you. Tomorrow will be another wonderful night. And before that night, faith clinic now is, is, is just too powerful. If I were you, I would not miss anyone. Do not miss, especially in time like this that we are about to cross. Do not miss. God bless you. Bless you real good. In Jesus' mighty name.